You're with News 5 tonight. The Migrant Workers Centre has noted a rise in cases involving salary-related disputes. Now, such cases made up the majority of the centre's workload in the first four months of this year. Some 600 migrant workers turned up this morning at the Cathay Cineplex for a free screening of the latest Spider-Man movie. It was one of several free movie screenings organised by the Migrant Workers Centre, or MWC, as part of its May Day celebrations and as a way of showing appreciation to these workers. For some, it was a welcome change from their usual Sunday routine. Up here, I never go outside, only stay room only. I, I don't like... Because I outside go, money also say lost. That's why I don't like. One hour, two hour temple. After go room say coming, cooking anybody, makan. Ata one hour, two hour sleeping. Beyond showing migrant workers that their hard work is appreciated, MWC said it will continue to push for fair employment practices for them. For example, it wants salaries to be paid through electronic means like gyro. The MWC says it's handled more salary-related disputes in recent years, and this includes issues like late payments, shortage of payments, and even non-payments. Now, the numbers show an increasing awareness of avenues that foreign workers can go to for help. In 2012, about half of the 2,500 cases MWC handled involved salary-related disputes, and this went up last year to about 60% of its 3,500 cases. MWC believes having electronic payslips can help tackle the problem. The problem today is that even if the workers come to us for us to handle their dispute, one key problem we face is still about the evidence. Based on a, a, a consistent amount, we will be able to know that the workers was paid fairly or not. Because for example, if there's any changes in the numbers, then we know that oh, there may be uh, illegal deduction or then there's something that we actually can follow up with the employers to find out more and to help the workers further. Manpower Minister Tan Chuan Jin said earlier this year that his ministry will study Mr Yeo's suggestion regarding electronic salary payments. MWC also said it will work with the Manpower Ministry to implement a model employment contract as well as emphasise the importance of skills upgrading for migrant workers.